All right, guys, so earlier we mentioned prep work for your baby, getting your home and your health ready. And as a mom-to-be, I know the number of doctor's visits, ultrasounds, and other tests, it can all kind of blur together after uh -huh. a while. Very, very true. Absolutely, but there's something that should stand out, and that is prenatal screening. It's crucial to helping doctors rule out the possibility of a certain genetic disease or certain genetic diseases and fetal conditions, including Down syndrome. Mm -hmm. And it can be as simple as a blood draw. So we're talking about non-invasive prenatal testing or NIPT. So let's break it down. With an NIPT like Panorama, for example, doctors can draw some of mom's blood as early as nine weeks into her pregnancy and this helps them check your developing baby's DNA to see if they're at risk for certain genetic diseases. And Panorama is actually the only NIPT that differentiates between mm -hmm mom's DNA and fetal DNA, and that produces nice. highly accurate results. Yeah, it's a huge bonus because those more accurate results can reduce the number of women who are incorrectly told their fetus may have a problem, and that could help them avoid the more invasive follow-up diagnostic tests like amniocentesis or CVS, which do carry a small risk of miscarriage. And we really have to keep in mind, the more you know early on, the better for your peace of mind. So early screening may help you prepare for your baby's future, including including selecting a hospital and physician prepared to provide the best care for your child at birth and beyond. And just remember, these are only screening tests. Yeah, that's a right. really good point, Jada. Yeah. If you were to receive a positive screening result from an NIPD, you'd want to get additional tests to confirm mm -hmm. it. It's a lot like the way a woman who, let's say, her mammogram showed potential breast cancer right. would undergo a, a biopsy, yeah. right? Okay, yeah. that makes sense. And just more, one more thing, if you can't wait to paint that nursery pink or blue, Panorama can also determine the gender of your baby as early as nine weeks gestation, and you can get those results within seven Come on. Days. So <laughs> you're saying I didn't have to wait on pins and needles until I was 20 nope. weeks, 20 That's weeks right. you didn't have to, wait, to find out. Amazing. <laughs> this is really cool though because a lot of times I think you hear genetic screening and you think oh it's going to be this invasive thing mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. But the fact that you could do a simple blood test that early on, it just makes it so easy. Right, you and know? you're getting blood taken for lots of other things in those first few weeks right. of pregnancy anyway, right. so no big deal. And I'm sure it's smart emotionally too to prepare for the good and the bad. Absolutely, you know? the more you know, the less anxiety. So with the anxiety reduction is always helpful. Yeah, all right ladies, so let's get informed and get prepared. If you want to learn more about Panorama and to find a screening location near you, you can head to their website, it's panoramatest.com and check that out.